What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, the real Brianna P, and welcome back to Chat with Bri. It's Vlogmas Day 2. Y'all already know what's up. We about to get right into it. Your girl is pressed for time. So at this point, let's get right into this video. So guys, I do have a list. Y'all seen that title? Let's normalize it. At this point, it's just like, let's normalize a lot of stuff. I've been seeing that word very frequently. Oh, the sun is coming out. Let's get back into it. The sun distracted me. It's been so like foggy and you know, but yeah. So guys, I've been seeing the word normalize a lot and I really think that people are just becoming more aware of like just certain things that people may try to shade, but it's just like, it's completely normal to do this. It's completely normal to do that and let's normalize it. So that's the purpose of this video. Before we get into anything, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button because if you're watching me, you fucks with your girl, so why not subscribe, okay? Make sure you like and comment as well because y'all know, y'all know I chats back in the comments, period. So guys, I do have a list I have a list and some of some of the things that's on this list are from Instagram that I happen to agree with and some of them are my own you know I feel like we should just normalize certain stuff so let's just get into it so number one normalize growing apart from people understanding that it is completely okay to grow apart for some from someone or multiple people like it doesn't make you a bad person you're literally trying to grow within yourself within life overall and that may be outgrowing some people and that's okay like it's not the end of the world that you're gonna outgrow like it's gonna happen quite often in your life anyway um i think it's very important for people to understand that people come in your life at, for like different seasons you know what i mean and it's not it, it, it's not a bad thing that they're not in your life the next season like they just didn't fit that puzzle in your life you know you were at a specific time period in your life someone came in your life it was fun and then now they're not in your life it's like life goes on guys it's not the end of the world people come for seasons and for a reason and they come to teach you lessons and that's it you know so take everything with a grain of salt just i'll grow them normalize that and call it a day for number two Let's see, for number two, normalize overall unity within your culture and not only on holidays, weddings, and funerals. Yes, like, guys, we gotta normalize that. We gotta normal, we have to normalize being with our family more often, linking up, like having drinks, getting something to eat, just family time, game night, something. Now, of course, we know COVID is <coughs> in the way, but we need to normalize just when things get back to normal literally being one like it shouldn't be oh that's my family they're way over there but we don't really talk to them like that oh that's my family they're way down there but we don't really mess with them like that like come on just life is way too short and family is important so normalize that for four normalize not having beef with people and just understanding that you're not their vibe like I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all seen that one on Instagram. It's no beef. <laughs> there was never no beef with anyone. Like, literally, even with me. First of all, beef. That's like so high school, seriously. You shouldn't have beef with anyone. Everybody are adults. You should be able to talk it out. And if you can't talk it out, just don't talk at all. And like, it's that simple. You may not be compatible with a lot of people. And that is okay. They're not your vibe. You do things a certain way. They do things a certain way. And that's just that on that. Let's normalize that, okay? We got to normalize that because people feel like, oh, she stopped talking to me. She must feel beef no like what <laughs> you don't rock how they rock i don't rock how you rock rock a boat <laughs> like i don't know um let's see normalize shutting your damn mouth if you don't have something nice to say don't say it yeah we gotta normalize that because a lot of y'all be talking out yes you know what I mean? Certain things don't need to be said. We got to normalize understanding that. Like, I'm pretty sure y'all parents taught y'all that in school. If you don't got nothing nice to say, don't say it. 
And it's really that simple, even in your adult years. If you see something, you're like, ooh. You know what I mean? Like, prime example. And this may be a little mean, but I'm just giving you an example. When I was in a braiding shop, you know, this lady, I really thought this lady was pregnant. She really looked, you know, and it was like, it wasn't like no sloppy, like, you know what I mean? Like her stomach, it was her mainly her stomach and it was like shaped in a ball to me. It kind of looked like she was pregnant. But I'm not going to say congratulations or I don't know the lady. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I'm not going to say congratulations or, oh, how many months are you? Like, that ain't, that ain't my business. And then come to find out, one lady actually said something and the lady was never pregnant. She was never pregnant. So that's why. Just keep it quiet because the whole time sis was never even pregnant. She was just, you know, out there. If that makes sense. No shade, girl. No shade, but you know. So, um, oh, law enforcement. Law enforcement. Let me see the time. I got time. Okay, I got time. Um, we need to normalize cops. Stop hiding in a cut. And just be patrolling the streets. And if you see somebody doing wrong, give them a ticket. Don't be in a cut. Because if I'm... And, and you right there, I ain't even see you. I ain't even see you. Like, you trying to catch me slipping. Why are you trying to catch me slipping? Just be on the street with it. Patrol. So I know, oh, cops. But if I'm, you know, I can't see you. Gosh, why the cops like to hide in the cut like that? And they be dead smack in the cut. Like, you will not even see them. Law enforcement, normalize y'all cops just being on the streets and regularly patrolling the neighborhood the city the town don't be in a cut let's normalize that <sighs> gosh okay and i don't know I, I, that was like six things i listed so mm. i mean if you feel there's anything else that you would like normalize feel free to drop it in the comments but i really feel like i touch bases on a vast majority of topics that people would like normalizing. I also saw another um, another topic on Instagram, and it said normalize like ghosting people. <laughs> like, like let's normalize that. Like it literally said. Hold on, let me see if I can find it, y'all. Cause wait, I forgot how it went. Um, I think La put it on her thing too. Let me see. Where is that? Oh, here it go. Wait. Y'all, my phone is... It just be acting. My server... AT&T is supposed to be the best. Okay, here it go. Normalize ghosting mother... You know, at first. After you already repeatedly told them what bothers you. Like, you, you telling somebody, please don't do that. Because I don't like when you do that. Or... And then they still do it. Ghost them. Boom. <laughs> Ladies, it is not that deep. It's not rocket science. You told them what you don't like. They keep doing it. Peace. Like, it's that simple. And I feel like that goes with everybody. Everybody. If you clearly see something irritates me and you constantly do it. Ghost. At this point, I'm Casper. <laughs> like... You know what I mean? Like, people just really be... They don't... They're not using what's up here to the best of their ability. So, by any means necessary. Toodaloo! So, guys. That's it. That's all for Vlogmas Day 2. And I know a lot of y'all like, how does this relate to Christmas? Baby, it's Christmas coming up. It's December. And Vlogmas is every day we post it. So, you know, I'm going to incorporate a little Christmas, you know, Christmas carols. Yeah, and yeah. But baby, it's Vlogmas Day too, whether you like it or not. Period. If y'all like this video, make sure you leave me a big fat thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all already know what's up. I chat back in the comments. Toodaloo.